Now at 11, former President Donald Trump plans to appeal a jury's recommendation that he pays E. Jean Carroll over $83 million. The verdict is the second time in the past year a jury has awarded Carroll millions in damages from Trump. It follows Carroll's claim that the former president raped her back in the 90s and then defamed her by denying it. Now, Trump is the rare defendant that could actually afford to pay an amount like this, and he has options to pay. Now, Trump could pay in cash or through his real estate holdings, but how does the court ensure that the money is there? We asked a former Department of Justice trial attorney. You could either pay the five, uh, the, the $983.3 million um, into the court and have the court hold it, which I believe is what he did with the $5.5 million judgment um, that came earlier. Uh, otherwise, he could he could secure a bond in which he would pay a portion of uh, of the amount it's unclear what amount of money Trump would have to pay if he used a bond or how much collateral he'd have to offer up, but it would come with fees and interest.